Did you hear about one about the underpants? Hippity hoppity hello everybody! My name is Elisa, welcome to my channel. I'm queer and so are my sims. Today we are doing the rags to riches challenge. If you're interested in the rules, the link will be in the description. So, after last week's episode... Okay, it was actually two weeks ago at this point because I took last week off because I was overwhelmed by the state of the world and our nation. You know, pandemic stuff. Anyways, sorry about that. Where I was getting so frustrated because I couldn't move around the house. Their desk wasn't working, their kitchen wasn't working, their bathroom wasn't working, nothing was working. It was very frustrating. I rearranged it at least three times during the episode. So I decided to re do their whole house. So it's gonna look way different. So let's start with a little house tour. Here is the house. It is still a micro home, although it doesn't necessarily look like it, but I rearranged it. And let's do a little house tour, shall we? So you come in the front door. Oop, we're still too tall, okay. So you come in the front door. Over here you still have the couch and the shelf with all of our fun objects on it. Right in front of you is the bathroom and then to the right you have a kitchen. You have the lesbian pride flag uh, with some two bar stools on the kitchen counter and very small kitchen. Through here you have the bathroom which looks the same as it did before. Um, and then through the back you have this door. You come through here and we have the garden. Everything is under this roof, so it will all grow during every season. Uh, this is just open space. It's not considered part of the house. It's just under the roof. Um, but I did put some, using it as storage kind of. Right here we have our plant that we can mold. Plant that we can mold? Yeah, I guess so. Um, over here, there's nothing in here either. Uh, I just put this little archway to under the stairs. Oop, that's not wallpapered. Um, because one of my sims, Rebecca, got trapped down there as I was playtesting it. Whoops. So just in case that ever happens again, I put the archways there so that it could get out. So then we come up the stairs. Oop. We have their wedding pillar. And we come into their bedroom where they both are right now. They have their bed, they have a little reading nook in the corner, they have a desk that overlooks the garden. Um, you can't see it right now, I guess it doesn't work like that. And then the microphone to practice the comedy. So that is the house. Um, I hope you all like it. I had a lot of fun building it. You maybe saw it on my Instagram, I posted it there when I made it. So... With that, let's jump into some gameplay. So we have Maggie here, has work in three days, needs to play some video games. Uh, well, she's browsing the web, so why don't we go ahead and have her play. Why don't you enter a novice tournament, try and make some money off of it while you get that up. Your skills are all good. And then we'll work on some of your aspiration. And Rebecca, you are doing well also. So you need to weed or water a plant 10 times, which surely we could do. And why don't you water all the plants? So break, team, break. So I was thinking we could use the spaces under these roofs as we expand the house. I wouldn't have to put down floor tiles and make it officially part of the house. We could keep micro home status and spread out a little bit, which is kind of cheaty, but I might do it. Uh, let me know in the comments if you think that's cheating and I shouldn't do it. Okay, so she completed her video games for the day, which is awesome. So we'll let her finish the tournament and then do some collecting. We'll have her dig around for crystals and fossils, and which reminds me, we should breed our frogs. Ooh, level five video gaming, good job. And Rebecca completed her milestone. We are starting off with a bang, friends. Because I renovated the house, they don't have much money, so we're gonna need to start building that up. Ooh, and you can sell Every Maggie, we're gonna have you go to your favorite romp. Ooh, I want you to 
harvest all the plants, then we can plant those as well. So why don't you plant these? You are both hungry and sleepy, so why don't you get leftovers, then go to sleep, and Rebecca, plant these mushrooms, and then you can also get leftovers. Oh, look at them. Sing about new skill day. So I had this thought. They need to become grandparents to complete the challenge, but I don't really want to have kids in this challenge. I will if I have to, but Rebecca hates kids, so I don't really want to force her to have kids. What if we had a puppy that had puppies? So thinking having grand dogs or cats instead of human dog human dogs or cats human babies let me know in the comments what you think okay Rebecca so let's see your needs are really good you need to pee take a shower and then you're good for work so why don't we travel to go collect crystals and fossils somewhere. All right, wow, remember all the time we spent here at the beginning of the challenge? Oh, and we had all of this and we spent so long at the woodworking table. Ugh. She's just miserable all the time. The mems. We can extract a fossil. Ooh, what do we get? Appaloosa Plains postcard. Ooh, we got a crystal, we got a fossil. Citrine, nice. Rummage these trash cans. We'll dig here, we'll look for frogs here. Let's extract this fossil. Broken fossil, Come look for frogs. And then you can go home and take a shower. Feel dirty. She just rages in there, grabs out a frog. A dirt frog. Dirt, dirt, dirty dirt frog. All right, go home. Okay, you can hop in the shower. Rebecca, what are you doing? Just browsing the web. Why don't you prune shape a waterfall shape? Yeah, that'd be fun. Let's see what we got. So we got a dirt frog, leaf frog, and a surfer leaf frog. We got a prehistoric hoof print fossil. Broken fossil, minnow, citrine, turquoise, two alabaster, which I think we got up there on the crystals. Yeah, we got four out of five that we needed. We only got one fossil though. Socialite, let's open up this time capsule. We got a postcard. Nice, okay, so we made like $250 plus whatever we got in this time capsule. Let's breed some frogs. Let's see, let's breed this dirt surfer with the leaf frog. And why don't you read gardening level three, volume three. Now they're just talking, just chatting. Um, did you go up at all in your gardening? I don't think so. Why don't you tell jokes, why not? Did you hear about one about the underpants? It's a real... I don't have a good joke. <laughs> I was gonna try, but it didn't work. Turns out the competitors in the tournament were better than Maggie. No prize this time. Dang. But Rebecca reached comedy level two. A nice girl. After you do some more comedying, get some leftovers, research gardening after that yeah that'll be good but first let's get your comedy skill up to level three it's there 108 percent there we go nice you can research gardening does this affect anything or is it just like something to do her gardening skill is not going up well maybe we should have her do a hobby that makes money let's see why don't you right you could also play games um
Why don't you play Blick Block? Your fun's up pretty high already, but ooh, you are focused. Look at that bar going up. That is crazy. Crazy fast. Oh, the computer broke. Okay. Can you repair it, please? You're playing games too much. Broke the computer. But you acquired the handiness skill and reached level two of the handiness skill at the same exact time. That's pretty impressive. Um, scavenge for parts. Cool. Did we get any parts? Yeah, we got three. Nice. And you're going to go to bed. Great. Right. Good night, ladies. All right, so Maggie is going to go to work in seven hours. So when she wakes up, we will have her eat. There she goes. Go get something to eat. And then maybe before work, you can do some programming. Why don't you hack? Ooh, work performance. Interesting. I don't want to do that too soon. Maybe eventually. <laughs> um, okay. Programming. Let's mod app. Mod Blick Block for your wife. She'll enjoy that. You don't want to sit while you eat? Ooh, look at all the plants. They're so pretty. Oh, Rebecca will be able to harvest some today. That'll be awesome. Let's see. $84 from those roses. 228 from those roses. Yeah, we're going to be banking today. That's exciting. All right, you're energized. Got work in three hours. And let's see, you can sell all of these Christmas roses. Programming level nine, she can now make computer games. That's awesome. Let's see, we were at like around $500 before she started doing this. So we'll see how much we get from this. So far, so good. I love gardening. I love gardening. Okay, so go pee and then go to work. Still in your PJs. And we have made um, about 1200 so far from harvesting. That's exciting. And work for Maggie starts, it says in about one hour. I think my notifications are lagging. At work until six. Why don't you water the plants? Sell this, sell this, and then... Why don't you come do some harvesting and digging? You can harvest the strawberries. You can dig. Potential awkward conversation. Love it. Maggie sees that the next customer in the chat queue is an old flame of hers and things didn't exactly end prettily. <gasps> the other agents are tied up. Should she respond to the chat request or pretend not to notice? Oh, just speak in the chat. Lucky for Maggie, the relationship wasn't as memorable as she thought, or at least the flame doesn't acknowledge her name or chat picture. Maggie meets with this customer's service needs and avoids the awkward confrontation. Performance game? Small. All right. And Rebecca, you can look for frogs here. Let's see, what did we get? Um, we got a spotted eggplant frog. So why don't you, what, what happened there? It just disappeared. Breed your dirt surfer frog. Yeah. Let's see, where are my bluebells? That's over here. Yes. 
So why don't you plant some more bluebells and strawberries. Oh, these are the strawberries, aren't they? We can sell the ruby. We can plant the mushrooms. We can extract the fossil. Plant imprint. Nice. We can sell that. She leveled up. Cooking. Nice, girl. And let's see. We can... Plant the strawberries. We're gonna have to rearrange this garden after the episode. That's fine. So many strawberries, okay. Um, plant, plant the things, then you can go to bed. I don't know why you're so tired. You left just fine look at our trees okay but you're gonna have to water those first you'll sleep really well tonight after after being so tired from planting And Maggie's almost home. We'll see what she brings in from work. Okay, y'all, we started this episode with $30. Look at us now. We even paid our bills in this episode, so that's exciting. We are doing so well. And Maggie should be coming home. Oh, I didn't tell her to, like, work hard or take it easy or meet people or anything. Oh, she was just working as per usual. Not work until six. It's six. Although she left. <gasps> Look at all our trees. Maggie got a promotion to quality assurance. She will now make an additional seven dollars per hour for a total of forty-one per hour. Plus, she received a boneless, boneless. <laughs> like the wings, a bonus of $375 stainless steel auto pot. Awesome. Good job. Oh, I missed your call. Okay, why don't you, what is your work task? Play video games? Yeah, and you're super stressed. So why don't you come here and play The Refuge? And where, oh, you're watering the plants, which is like awesome, but you didn't finish planting the plants. You're very tense from low fun. Okay, you are tired. So why don't you go to sleep? And you... You're getting your fun up, and then after you do that, you can go to sleep. Awesome, awesome. Play that video game. Play that video game. Play that video game. The Refuge. Refuge. All right, well, um... Maggie's about to head to bed, and I think that is a great place for me to leave this episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you would like to see more videos like this, make sure to click the subscribe button. I post Let's Plays on Saturdays and Speed Builds on Tuesdays. If you want to follow me on social media, that information will pop up around me. I am fairly active on Instagram, posting three times a week. So make sure to follow me on your favorite social media platform. And with that, I hope you all have a great rest of your day. I'll see you next time. Bye!